Hello friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. We are home after over 3,000 miles of travel. We are so happy to be home. We had the absolute best time while we were gone. And um, in the words of my husband and Dorothy, there's no place like home. So we are so glad to be back. I wanted to do a couple of videos, just really quick ones, of some goodies that I found. Um, if you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is a channel mostly about crafting and planners and things like that. But I also just went to a work conference, so I wanted to share some goodies that um, I have absolutely loved, where I found them, and how I'll utilize them in my business. So, the first thing I found, and I have been using these for a while, are these incredible sticky note tab notebooks. They're by Ready Tag. I bought them on Amazon. And hands down, I carry these everywhere. These were invaluable when I was taking notes at our conference. I absolutely highly recommend these. I found um, someone on Amazon and I ordered, uh, you know, six of them. So, you know I'm, I'm hooked. <laughs> I made sure to order more before we left the conference because I had one. I don't know where I found it, but point blank, um... That was a tool I used the whole time during the conference. We were given huge three-ring binders, and, um, and, and it just wasn't enough. We also had notebooks. Each of us took a, um, let me see, let me grab this one. This one was my husband's, but um, I think I shared these before in a video when I bought them in a work haul. And we took copious notes throughout the conference. So, um, I wrote a lot more than my husband. But anyways, <laughs> he, he was so cute. But I used these as well. I mean, what planner girl doesn't need more sticky notes? And these have tabs. So anyways, long story short, love these. Another thing I picked up that I wish I would have had for the conference. Um, I was looking online afterwards for some things that I needed. And I saw this. This is... Um, this is from Amazon, Top Focus Notes, and I was purchasing some other things that we needed, and I realized that ugh, this would have been so much better. Total planner girl. Um, I would take my notes here, I would put my highlighted information here, and I would have summarized at the end of the day. Okay, I'm going to make sure that's all in frame. Sorry, guys. Um, but long story short, love it. Date and purpose. Um, I cannot... I can't wait to use this for the next conference. Our conference was four days jam-packed. So um, there was no time to wait. There was no time to chat. It was amazing. The, the company that put it on did a phenomenal job. They opened and closed in prayer, which was a, you know, I love that. And um, we met, our, our connection list is huge. And some of those people, I hope we stay friends with for the rest of our lives. They were, it was the most generous group of people that literally shared whatever tool or resource that they had. Um, we weren't in competition with each other. We were there to encourage each other, and that was fantastic. Um, our businesses will be opening end of the summer, first of all. We'd hope it open in July, but um, licensing takes longer than what I had thought it was going to take. And so, anyways, but um, phenomenal, phenomenal um, uh, conference, phenomenal speakers, phenomenal prep preparation. And um, we had every, even down to the hotel was a Marriott, and they went out of their way to make sure that one of the days they, they claimed they didn't do much for the vegetarians, so they went out of their way and on the last day made us a special meal. I mean, really? That was just above and beyond. And we were in Bradenton, Florida. Gorgeous place. We went to an amazing restaurant. If you're ever there, go to O'Bricks, I think is how you say it. Um, the manager there was phenomenal. Um, we absolutely thought the food was amazing. It's a restaurant and bar. And, of course, we ate dinner at the restaurant. And you can even sit outside and... Um, but the amazing thing was, we went the first night, and not many people were there, so we really got to talk to the manager a whole lot and the waitress. And anyways, we went. We were going to go to Florida, uh, 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 Disneyland, Disney World in Florida, in Orlando. We ended up not going, 
because my girls were so sweet to me. They knew I wanted to go to Clearwater and to the aquarium there and get to see Winter from Dolphin Tales, if you haven't seen that. They do a lot of work with special needs um, and, uh, you know, special needs patients and um, clients and um, post-traumatic stress. I mean, it is amazing the work they do there. And, of course, I was in hog heaven and anything to do with the dolphin. And um, But we went there for the day, and my girls begged my husband to drive all the way back to O'Bricks, and we ate dinner there. The manager was so sweet because we thought we were going to even change hotels and go to another city, go to Orlando. And he goes, I thought you guys were going to, you're going to start making your way home. And we said, well, actually, we fed my husband snacks so we could come back to a restaurant. And he was so tickled by that. He um, he gave us a dessert. He, he brought us a dessert for the table. It was amazing. The food is phenomenal. And uh, my I have a hard time eating food um, that's not, you know, made at home, and um, eating out is very hard for me, and, and being vegetarian, but I have a lot of GI tract issues, and so, long story short, um, I absolutely adore, if you go there, they do a, an eggplant um, rolls, and they are phenomenal if you're a vegetarian, they are phenomenal if you're a pescatarian, uh, the table had multiple, multiple uh, different fish dishes. They all loved them. They even went back and just reordered the same the next night. That's how good everything was. And their salads are amazing. Absolutely best salad I've ever eaten out. O'Bricks in Bradenton, Florida. Mark is the nicest guy and uh, the waitress, especially our first night, was she went out of her way to make sure we didn't eat anything with that we'd be allergic to food-wise or I mean, she just asked every question, and I wish I would have gotten her name. She was just amazing, and um, and so as we left, he came and said, you know, goodbye to us as we were walking out the restaurant, and he goes, hey, by the way, um, if you decide to stay another night, see you tomorrow night. So <laughs> my girls started laughing, going, do you think we could do that? And so we were like, no, no. So anyways, but um, amazing trip. Again, over 3,000 miles driven. We went to uh, Oak Alley Plantation in Louisiana, near New Orleans. We went to Bellingrath Gardens. Here's Bellingrath Gardens uh, near Mobile, Alabama. The gardens are phenomenal. The mansion is phenomenal. We went to Clearwater Marine and Aquatic. I can't remember if it's, I can't remember it. Maybe just the Clearwater Aquarium. Amazing, amazing, amazing work there. Um, Gosh, I can't even remember all the places we went. We walked, I went to the Aviation Museum in Pensacola, the Naval Aviation Museum in Pensacola. Um, oh gosh, it was just an endless list. We never, the conference was packed, the evenings were packed, the travel was packed. I, I had to get a cane, I, you know, but that's okay. We use the tools that we need, you know. And my arthritis kind of had a hard time on the way over, but by the time we came home, I was doing better. Um, I can't remember all the things we did. It's just crazy. But long story short, an amazing trip. Thank you so much to everybody who sent me the sweetest messages. Y'all were so kind, and I appreciate everything you guys um, send. And, and you encourage each other. You encourage me. It's an amazing group of people that... Um, are part of this channel and, and 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 it's much you guys as it is me sharing my little thing so anyways long story short just wanted to quickly share some goodies um oh i gotta share this one thing oh my gosh my husband is a huge chocolate guy so we went somewhere i think it was in alabama and i'll i'll i can't remember anyways it was an outlet a russell stover's outlet now, I love chocolate. I'm like any girl. I love me some chocolate. But my sweet husband, when he sees that there is a Russell Stover store, he drove way off the beaten path to get to it off the highway. And um, he came with literally almost, I think there are about eight of these. And I picked the two Christian ones. And um, yes, the well is dry. He's, our, he's so cute. Even that. This is empty. This was our freebie for our purchase. 
And um, I, it was just crazy. We had to go buy an ice chest because um, the, my husband and the girls spent a day at the beach in Pens Panama City. Uh, pardon me, no, Navarre Beach, Navarre Beach. And um, and I, I went and I had a lot to read and catch up on, so I did that. But they, he had a great time Brussels us over. Totally his thing. So, anyways, guys, if you're in that area, they have outlets, I guess, throughout the United States. I don't suggest going in there hungry because you come out with too much and then you have to buy a nice chest to get it home. So, all right, guys, uh, you guys have a great day. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. And again, thank you, thank you, thank you to everybody who has been so supportive and so kind. Um, I really appreciate that. And um, anyways, if you have a chance, um, hop on in, subscribe, um, share your feedback. Um, I, I, it's just an amazing group of people. I thank you so much. So talk to you later. Bye-bye.